is up YouTube it's Mitch at iPhoneCaptain.com and I've got something very exciting for you so I'm just going to jump in here with this video and share this one tweak with you which you know I've normally not been doing but I'm going to start doing that more if you want me to just share more of the better tweaks and show more features on each one give this one a thumbs up that'll let me know that you enjoyed it or drop a comment and let me know below anyway this is lock arch, lock arch, lock HTML4 it has just hit the scene recently not you know too recent but I just found out so recent for me and recent for you but anyway I have the repo you need I have the support you need I have it all right here guys as you can see right here's the change log up for the lock HTML 4 tweak it is beta form therefore it's free right now but I'm sure once it goes out of beta, there will be a fee. If you haven't purchased it already in years past, you may have to purchase it in the upcoming time. But, but right now, it is considered to be free. You can see here we have some different logs. If you want to read here, you can see that it is available uh, for 10.x. It is supported, I should say. There's been various fixes for timeouts, such things as that. But I wanted to show you that log to show you that was proof that it is working. Now here's lock HTML4 in the repo that I'm going to be sharing with you. And that repo is called repo.lockhtml.com. You will need to add that repo. If you don't know how to add a repo, we can do that really, really quick. Since this is just going to be a quick, simple, down and dirty type video, we'll go to sources. You go up here to edit. Over on the left side, you tap add. The little pop-up box comes. Right there, you need to enter repo.html lock or lockhtml.com. I'm sorry. It goes repo.lockhtml.com. Hit add source. It will run through the edition. Then you can go back in and tap the repo. Once you get the repo added, just tap, just tap on it right here. And it will open back up and it's under tweaks and you need to tap on lock HTML up here you tap modify then you tap install now if any of you out there download this and you have any problems there is a little there is a way for some of those fixes to be corrected and it's called you may need to install InfoStats 2 if you don't have any problems, don't deal with that, okay? But that is, go on, you, I'll leave the link to the Reddit. You can go on and read the comments too. This is where I learned this at. And also, I want to show you, of course, what it looks like. This is what it looks like. And you just, if you want to move this on the screen, just hold it hard on the screen and move it, okay? And it'll go into like a little wiggle jiggle mode. And then once you leave the lock screen again, go into the hit the home button it'll go away but guys this 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 developer has worked himself very hard he has added so many new options in here so many different things you can hide i can't wait to get some of these awesome new widgets for this that's coming down the pipe right now the only one we can use is that weather one it shows the weather with the uh, temperature and things of that nature, but you can come in here and set up all kinds of different things if you may want to hide something. Check it out, guys. Let me know what you think. You want more videos with more features, or you want more tweaks with more videos? Let me know in the comments. Hit that subscribe button if you aren't a subscriber. Share this video with all your friends so they know Lock HTML4 is ready. And keep coming back.